guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to an excited Wrestling Days because all of these figures turned up in a massive box this morning. I can't believe it. I had no idea what was in the box. Uh, I didn't even know where the box had come from. Uh, so that's why I opened it up and I found all of this stuff. Uh, so I've displayed it out here. I've got to give a massive thank you, a huge thank you uh, to everyone over at Mattel for sending these over. Um, I mean, it must be like some kind of early Christmas present. Uh, I know all of this stuff will be out before Christmas. Uh, let's go through it, shall we? We've got the Royal Rumble figures. Uh, I know that these are a Target exclusive. Uh, not sure about the UK. Um, they're coming before Christmas. You can see Bobby Lashley and Lita. We got The Rock as well. And this is the figure that everyone has been giddy about Macho Man Randy Savage. This is from Royal Rumble uh, 1991 uh, when he came running down and he smashed Ultimate Warrior in the head. Um, very, very cool. This Bobby Lashley as well comes with the ECW Heavyweight Championship. That is not a belt that we get that often. Uh, we got the Lita. We got the Rock with the spinner belt as well. I will try and do a separate video on that series uh, because it definitely deserves it. Uh, and as we said, these will be coming out this winter. So four very awesome figures there. Uh, moving on, we got Survivor Series. These are hitting stores now. Um, and you can see we got Jeff Hardy, Alicia Fox at the back there. Um, and then at the front, we've got Shinsuke Nakamura. And a first time to line for Don Morocco, Don Morocco, The Rock, Don Morocco, uh, an absolute legend. Look at that tie-dye top, um, absolutely brilliant. We got Shinsuke as well uh, in blue, and then at the back we've got Jeff Hardy. I think this is from 2006. Uh, you can see it's a very different look for Jeff Hardy compared to what he wears now. And then we've got Alicia Fox. That's when she was the captain a few years ago uh, of the Raw women's team. Uh, comes with a great hat. Uh, over here, look look at this. Masters of the WWE Universe. Uh, the Grey School Mania Battleground. Uh, you get John Cena and you get... Terra Claw Triple H. Um, I've got to tell you, these are more detailed than I thought they were. Uh, like, the faces on them are actually really good. Um, and let me just move these figures out of the way so you can kind of see what else you get. You get that ring. You get that battleground, uh, which is really, really cool. Uh, I do love play sets. Um, this, I believe, is a Walmart exclusive, so you can only get it from Walmart. Uh, we will look at that separately. Uh, right, we've got these as well. Ultimate editions, and this could be the best ever WWE Mattel action figure. Look at this Finn Balor. Uh, out now in the US. Coming soon to the UK. Look at the detail. Look at the expression uh, in the face. I love that tongue out. Uh, the body as well and the detail on the body. The swappable hands. Uh, comes with that little uh, skirt thing as well. Um, I don't know if it is a skirt or what it's called. A sarong maybe. Um, but it is awesome. We've also got this Triple H as well, which I know has got a lot of people excited. Uh, it comes with the big eagle. Uh, this is like Attitude Era. Triple H comes with like that chain link top. Uh, you get a bottle, you get the sledgehammer, you get swappable heads as well. Um, th this is awesome. This is awesome. Some of the best figures this year have been Ultimate Editions, so absolutely love those and we've still got more to look at we've got elite series 72 uh, these are out now in the u.s coming very soon to the uk uh, we've got the velveteen dream with that north american championship uh wearing an attire which i think was from a promo uh we've got batista uh, it's a, such a shame that this Batista has been packaged 
this way round because all the detail is on the back. The back of this figure is in Sane. So, uh, yeah, that is one to look out for. Uh, we got Buddy Murphy. First time to line for Buddy Murphy. Uh, the best kept secret with the Cruiserweight Championship. And then, of course, Roderick Strong. Roderick Strong is here. Uh, undisputed era. Uh, he has had some figures before, but I honestly don't think they actually got released or not. I don't think they did. Uh, a couple of basics. Um, so, very cool. We've got this Rey Mysterio as well. Uh, Rey Mysterio made his return on SmackDown 1000. I think this is the ring attire from that. Uh, it looks awesome. You can see the mohawk as well on the mask. Uh, the tattoo detail. Because uh, obviously he's got all these extra tattoos now uh, and we've got the man Becky Lynch I mean this could be it this could be the figure this Christmas uh, just think she has probably had the best year out of any WWE superstar winning the main event at Wrestlemania um, uh, just what an Becky two belts uh, what an incredible year. So this is the first man figure. Looks like they have got rid of the belly button issue as well. Uh, I can't see that indentation. Uh, comes with a man jacket, swappable hands. She's quite moody as well in the face. Um, but then she is a bit moody sometimes. So there we go. Look at all of this. What an incredible absolute incredible surprise thank you so much to Mattel for sending these through as we said we will do videos on these we will take a look at these in more detail we need to have a look at things like the uh, swappable hands on that Roderick Strong uh, because they're in the uh, undisputed era uh, kind of hand gesture uh, we need to take a look at that macho man a little bit more we need to look at that Lita we definitely need to look at that Finn Balor Ultimate Edition we got to look at the Masters of the universe stuff guys there's so much that we've got to do and we've got to look at uh, let me know down in the comments below out of all of these which was your favorite and i'll see you next time